Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm Dominic with Alexandria Camping Center. We're here today to introduce an all new line of product for us here at Alexandria Camping Center, the Alliance Avenue. This is an exciting product that was just launched at the later part of the season in September at Hershey. And we are here today showcasing our first model, the 32 RLS. So this model, obviously 32 feet in uh, kind of living space, but overall we're just over 35 feet long. This is a three quarter ton tow and uh, considered a wide body. So 101 inches wide, which is kind of unique for this segment. Usually you see that in the full profile fifth wheels. So Alliance really doing a bang out job with that, bringing something fresh and new to the segment. And we're really excited to showcase it here today. So let's get right into it. Before we open it up though, let's take a look inside just to showcase a little bit about the rig while the slides are closed. Just a few little things I want to point out. It has this 15 cube, 12 volt fridge by Norcold. It has 190 watt solar panel on the roof and then a 2000 watt inverter in the front um, storage compartment. So that allows you to get off the grid. While the slide is closed and you have full access to your fridge, it's very convenient if you're on the road, you want to grab a sandwich or fix some lunch, you got some great counter space to do so. It's nice to be able to access your unit without having to open it all up with all the slide outs when you're all ready to hit the road. The other things while traveling and talking about accessibility and slide outs and all that jazz, is is having access to the washroom so right from the entry door you're three steps away to the upper landing you have full access to your toilet and the full washroom so really nice setup we'll get into that more when we do the full walkthrough setup and the other thing is you you can jump right in the bed if you need you know take a little nap there's access to your king size bed here so fully accessible to your fridge your washroom and your bedroom let's go back to the front where we intro on the front I, I just taken away by this beautiful cap it's a painted cap kind of molded setup with the LED light for hitching at night in the evening so you can see what you're doing nice big Alliance sticker on the front and really cool color combo I think they did an outstanding job at the factory with this new product so on the front here we have the Kurt Rotoflex pin box. So this eliminates chucking when you're coming off the line and accelerating. There's a rubberized component in here that's just gonna smoothen out the load and just enhance the towing experience. We have your battery storage area along with the 2000 watt inverter we were talking about. And the inverter will convert the 12 power to 110 power if you wanted to run a Keurig coffee maker, your TV or whatnot. There's dedicated outlets in the coach. And this is all done right at Alliance. So really professionally done and um, allows, you know, people that want to camp a little more off the grid and not in the traditional spaces in the campground. Or let's say there's a shortage of campgrounds in, you know, this pandemic we're facing here today. So it allows you to maybe get into some more remote spots that normally you wouldn't be able to set up without a power source. So that's the battery box that's built in to the coach. Um, battery disconnect right above here. So when you're not using your coach, you can kill the, the batteries and just a, a storage area for some more of the out, outdoor gear. There's a light above here. This is on a motion sensor light setup, so you can have it on that setting. And then when you open this baggage door, it will automatically go on. When we talk about the weight of this coach, as previously explained, this is a three quarter ton tow. This is weighing in at an unloaded vehicle weight of 10,800 pounds. 13,995 is the GVWR gross vehicle weight rating. And that's a cargo carrying capacity of 2272 in pounds. So allowing you a lot of versatility when thinking of those longer camping adventures you may take in the winter. Down to Florida would be nice right around now because we, we got a lot of snow outside. 30 pound bottles, auto switch over regulator, one on each side, and that allows you to have some great storage in the front. This unit comes equipped with Lippert Ground Control 3.0. This is an auto level system. They have a nice little locking door here so nobody can play with your buttons, but this allows you to independently control the jacks as needed or just hit that auto level button, which is really a peace of mind, easy one, one step 
leveling. This is a 12 volt system, not a hydraulic system. So it draws less amperage for convenience, you know? Who wants to spend all day jacking up their trailer and leveling it out? Pass through, you have a heavy duty slam latch baggage door. As you can see, they're on struts. And the highlight over here on the opposite door side is this Nautilus water management system. You have all your connections that are in one location here. You can run your water line up from the bottom of the coach for the city water. You'd wanna put a pressure regulator on a, maybe a 90 there. And then you have your hot and cold on an outside shower. You have your black tank flush. And then you have all your little toggle valves here that allow you to do some dry camping, city water, winterize with the pump, sanitize, and you just follow the, the little diagrams. Cable and satellite prep, a GFI plug up here, motion sensor light over here, black tank flush, and then your, your gate valves so you don't need to bend under the coach trying to reach them. They're not getting corroded with the driving and the dirt and the grime from the road. So really nice and, and neat. And what I like is that they have made an access panel. So if anything needed to be serviced, you can simply just use this little bungee. I know our techs like that. And you know, the, the end user that, you know, likes to do stuff themselves or whatnot, having access is quite nice. Another motion sensor light here. This is the charge controller for the solar system. And this is a heated storage compartment. You can see the aluminum they're using in the bath deck. And then you have a motion sensor over on the other side of the pass-through. Hot water tank, your furnace, exhausting on the opposite door side. This is 50 amp service. CRE 3000, this is more ride. Really nice to enhance the towing on this coach. And those are wet bolts so you can grease and, and have just a, a better suspension system. They welded two inch steel tube to just solidify that suspension area. 3,500 pound springs, so really heavy duty on the suspension. Just doing a little more than the competition, which I think is excellent. You know, Alliance is really listening to the end user and putting a lot of things in their coaches that avid campers are looking to see. At the back here, we have a two inch receiver. You know, if you wanna carry a little boat or something behind you, this will do up to 3,000 pounds, 300 pounds on the hitch weight. Or, you know, more common is just, you know, the bike rack you have on the back of your vehicle already slides right into there. Um, but it does have the wiring and, and everything if you wanted to do more than that. On the back, there's some backup camera prep up there, LED lights, not only inside but outside on the coach you have a ladder to access the roof so up on the roofs there you can see there's dual air conditioners those are 13,500 BTU air conditioners which give you a total of 27,000 BTUs of air conditioning allowing you to keep this coach at the desired temperature and just beyond that first air conditioner you see 190 watt solar panel that's part of that off the grid camping package on this Alliance Avenue, which gives you the 2000 watt inverter, that big panel and that 12 volt fridge inside. Solid steps, which are adjustable on the bottom. This is a Lippert product and they're aluminum. You have a really big step on, on the top and a nice big grab handle to get into the coach. Something I'd like to point out is the Asdell sticker here. Alliance is doing this on their coaches to eliminate some of those, you know, issues people talk about when it comes to delamination. Asdell is just a superior product in lamination that will eliminate that problem for a lot of customers. So really nice to see they're spending a little bit more on that build construction that you don't necessarily see, but I see because we have a nice sticker here. Good job. 32 RLS. 32 feet living space, like I said, just over 35 feet overall length, three quarter ton tow, rear living, and slide. All right, so you see that too. Warranty for full-time RVing. So we're learning lots today. That's just saying that no problem if you wanna live in this full-time, 
They're not gonna nitpick you when it comes to the warranty like some manufacturers will. Really nice to see them standing behind their product with such a great warranty. LED lights under the awnings, dual awnings here. And these are power 12 volt units. We can't take them out all the way in our shop here today, but they go out eight feet and they're adjustable. Tons of sunshade and protection from the elements. And with the dual awnings as standard equipment, really enhances the camping area on the door side of your coach. Not to mention some outside speakers so you can listen to some tunes. Hook up your phone to the media system. Let's hop in, let's open these slides. Let's get to the exciting stuff. So nice to see on the, the control panel here is everything is independent. All the slides are independent buttons. So if you just need to access one slide, it's quite easy. These are rack and pinion slides down below in the lower deck. And then we got a Schwintec slide on the bed. Just want to make sure we got good room in here. All right, we're in business. Throw on some of these extra lights, brighten it up. Even though I think this is already a really bright coach, you know, the first impression I I had coming in here was, wow, it is so bright, even though the, the lights weren't on. But now they're all on. Like I said, rear living room, opposing slides, so lens to a really spacious living area, kitchen area. I love it. I think Avenue has hit so many boxes for me. And the first one is just brightening up the inside. White and kind of this lighter maple. Not sure what they'd call it yet as we haven't had formal training on it since it's so new. LED lights everywhere. The big atrium windows they have on the door side slide in throughout the entire coach even by the kitchen here. Wide body segment, you can feel the width as well. It's not a lot, you know, five, six inches, but it allows us to get this three-seater sleeper sofa into the rear. Typically, you only have a two-seater sofa. So when you have a wide body, it allows you to get a bigger piece of furniture in here. Storage compartments that are hidden is kind of one of the things that they've done very well in giving the customer extra usable storage. You've got USB charging and 110 plugs below. You have roller shades that helps when you want to, you know, get some privacy or just keep out the sun. You look at this media system right across from the theater seats, you have this modern style of fireplace, which will give you about 5,000 BTUs of heat. And then this television, which is on a swing arm and allows you to angle it accordingly and you get little bonus shelving behind the television on both sides some extra storage and then that just pops back into place and as you saw locks up some nice storage overhead and one thing i want to point out about these cabinets you heard them they have magnet latches and you see their soft closing so this is a really residential feel you don't see this too often on rvs you see a lot of you know, units that will have hidden hinges like this, but having the magnet catches and soft closing is just awesome in my book. I think they've really refined this product by doing that. Three burner range with a cool look. This glass recess top and backsplash, big window, countertop on both sides of the range. So this is great when you're cooking and you can never have enough counter space. Overhead, we have a 30 inch residential microwave with the fan built in and the light. Just great for when you're cooking away from home. Um, feels like home. And then you got a nice big drawer underneath the range for pots and pans, high rise pillow faucet. Something they, they want to point out is they have shut off valves at all the major fixtures in the coach. So if you ever have water leak, you can close it off just like at home so it doesn't end your, your weekend of camping and killing your whole water supply because you have a water leak. So this is really nice for service and, and people are gonna love that, I think. Freezer, it has some baskets in the bottom and then this little tray up top, so organizing it's nice. And then side-by-side -side French doors, tons of storage inside. This is a 15 cubic foot 
So a little bit bigger than the standard fridge that you see in a coach, nor cold 12 volt fridge. We have a big pantry here, tons of storage for all your dry goods. And then you kind of have this, you know, uh, whatever, coffee bar, whatever you want to call it. You could put a Keurig here, you have a plug under here, you have a light here. I like that accent they do just behind, little touches like that, just make this coach just feel really refined. Uh, USB charging, no lack of that. And then I like the finish they have on the cabinets on the uppers here. Uh, it's more of a frosted glass. Solid surface countertops. And then we have this kind of freestanding hybrid dinette. You have the bench on one side, you have two chairs on the other side. You have kind of a textured table, which matches the decor in here very well. And you'll notice that there's no pedestal. So this is anchored to the slide wall. So it's gonna allow the end user to just have great leg room and you're not bumping into the pedestal of the base of that table. Really cool. And then you have that ottoman which gives all that extra storage. You can pull this into the living room if somebody's sitting on the sofa and wants to put their feet up or just having, you know, uh, place settings or games that you, you want to store away. Look at the size of these windows, folks. Just tons of natural light is going to come here. There's a deep tinted safety windows and then you've got those roller shades. Um, and there's no overheads here impeding the um, visibility to your campsite. There's no carpeting. So they're using the same flooring they are on the main area into the slide. There's no step up on the kitchen slide here, which a lot of people have. So this is flush floor. So the engineering team at Alliance Avenue just killing it there. Oh, and then we have a fantastic fan over there. You look at the pennant lights, just a beautiful coach. You don't really like that, the dimmer feature. So, you know, if you find these lights too bright, you can just dim them right down. Really cool. Nice feature. You don't see that in too many trailers. And then we have the fantastic fan or max air fan um, control with four speeds, automatic open and close. So when you're cooking, it, it's an additional fan to help ventilate that area. And then we have this monitor panel that will control your tank heaters. So this allows you to do colder weather camping with 12 volt tank heaters on your holding tanks. And then you've got a lot of your lights and then gas electric on the hot water, your water pump. And you have two awnings on this coach. Um, so really cool there. One thing I want to point out is as you come in, you have a spot to put your shoes. So usable storage. We always need a place to put our shoes to keep the coach clean. So moving up, side aisle bath. We have pocket doors, which I love. So closes off the washroom as needed and it doesn't impede into your hallway catching somebody that's coming from the bedroom. So we have a nice big shower over here. Has a seat built in, so if you're just having a tough morning, you wanna relax, good height with the skylight for more natural light. I gotta point this out. You see the sticker, but this is something that you see in residential homes. I have not seen a fifth wheel or trailer with a soft close toilet seat. I know it's random, but I guess if you have visitors and you're going to the washroom in the night, having that not make a ton of noise, nice touch. Good storage next to the shower for your towels and linens. So let's go to the master bedroom. We have a dimmer switch, so you know if you want to play around with the lights, you can. Storage, storage under the bed. This is a king size bed, 50 amp service power cord here that comes with the coach. And then you have your nozzle for the outside shower and struts holding it up. Windows in the bed area, 
so it feels a little more airy and less claustrophobic for some of those who don't like tight spaces. USB charging, 110 plug on both sides um, with a little shelf for your water, or your book, or your cell phone, or CPAP machine, whatever you like. And then you have a nice big closet, washer dryer hookups in here. So you could put a combo together on one side or you can break it down and put two units there. Shelving built in, tons of hanging space and a shelf above. Nice big closet with these barn doors with the mirrors. Don't forget to latch that when you hit the road. So what do you think? Comment below, tell us how you like this brand new avenue. We're really excited here at Alexandria Camping Center. Loving this new product. We're gonna be showing you more. Please subscribe to our channel. Stay tuned for more videos to come and have a great day.